hierarchical system. Any resistance is crushed. On the 15th of November, 1539, the Abbot of Glastonbury and two of his monks are taken to the top of Glastonbury Tor. Found guilty of high treason, the punishment to be hanged, drawn and quartered. I think the action against the Abbot of Glastonbury is interesting because, of course, he was an elderly figure. You can't imagine him being this kind of rabble-rouser, really. But I think his action might potentially mobilise resistance elsewhere. And, of course, this just simply had to be stamped upon. The frail and elderly Abbot, Richard Whiting, addresses the crowd. I pray for God's mercy. And His Majesty the King, forgive me for whatever great offence... I commit it. Strangled until barely breathing. Cut down. Disemboweled alive. He won't die until his body is cut into quarters. So somebody had to sit down and go, I've got a good idea. Let's keep him alive, right? We'll cut him out, but you've got to keep him alive, right? Okay, why? Oh, wait, just...